Hi friends, consider the number 11, this number is a prime. Next consider 111, this number is composite because it is divisible by 3 as well as 37. Numbers like 11, 111, 1111 are known as repunit. So they are either prime or composite. We now consider a repunit number 11111. How many ones? 2023 ones. 2023 ones. 2023 is the current year and a blog post about this number 2023 is available in the blog Math1089. The link for the same is available in the description box. Now what about this number 11111 2023 times 1. This number is either prime or composite. So the question that we will consider in this video is so that the repunit number 11111 2023 times 1 is a composite number. This number is not a prime number. How we are going to show that? We will show that by showing that this particular number has got more than 2 distinct factors more than two distinct factors pause the video if you'd like to give it a try please subscribe to our channel math1089 now consider the given question the number or the repunit number is 11111 times 1 is appearing we can write it like 1 into 10 to the power 2022 plus 1 into 10 to the power 2021 plus dot 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 1 into 10 plus 1. It is a finite GP series with first term 1, common ratio 10. What is the sum of this series? The sum of this series is 10 to the power 2023 minus 1 by 10 minus 1. As a result, we now have to show that 10 to the power 2023 minus 1 by 10 minus 1 is a composite number. If we see this expression, it looks odd. But if we write this expression in a different way, that may help us to conclude that yes, it is a composite number. What is the trick? We will write it like this. 10 to the power 2023 minus 1 by 10 to the power 7 minus 1 into 10 to the power 7 minus 1 by 10 minus 1. A question. From where 10 to the power 7 minus 1 is coming or what is the need for introducing this particular number 10 to the power 7 minus 1. Please look at the prime factorization of 2023. It is 7 into 17 into 17. Since the presence of 7 is important in 2023, so we will divide 10 to the power 2023 minus 1 by 10 to the power 7 minus 1. After dividing, what will be the result? Now, here is one important formula how to divide. If p is more than q, then we have 10 to the power p minus 1 by 10 to the power of q minus 1 equal to 10 to the power of p minus q plus 10 to the power p minus 2q plus dot 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 10 to the power of q plus 1. Using this formula, we can write 10 to the power 2023 minus 1 by 10 to the power 7 minus 1 as 10 to the power 2016 plus 10 to the power 2009 plus dot 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 10 to the power 7 plus 1. The other number 10 to the power 7 minus 1 by 10 minus 1 can be written as 10 to the power 6 plus 10 to the power 5 plus dot 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 10 plus 1. Hold on. If someone is not interested for this particular term, the introduction of this particular term 10 to the power 7 minus 1, they might think of in a different way like this. 10 to the power 23 minus 1 by 10 to the power 17 minus 1 and again into 10 to the power 17 minus 1 by 10 minus 1. Again, 17 is there 
in the prime factorization of 2023. What is the result in that case? The first factor will be 10 to the power 2006 plus 10 to the power 1989 plus dot 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 up to 1 and the other factor is 10 to the power 16 plus 10 to the power of 15 plus dot 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 up to 1. Here we will consider the first one. So two factors are 10 to the power 2016 plus 10 to the power 2009 plus dot 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 10 to the power 7 plus 1 and the other factor 10 to the power 6 plus 10 to the power of 5 plus dot 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 10 plus 1. Clearly the first factor is more than 1. It is quite evident from the representation of the number. Again the second factor is also more than 1 which is also quite evident. Moreover, the first factor is different from the second factor. First factor and second factors are completely different. So what you can see that the rep unit number which is given like 11111 ones are there, that particular number has got two factors. Both the factors are different from each other. As a result, the given number, that means the rep unit number 11111 up 2023 times is a composite number. So the given rep unit number is a composite number. Thank you for watching this video. Please follow us on Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn and Twitter.